Can you see the small meme there? There you go. That's a new type of gunna that I am about to teach you. So every time in Quran you see a small meme, you know that this is a reverse type of gunna. So what do we do here? Well, we change noon into meme. We change the gunna into um. But when? Well, when you see a noon or tanween and you see ba after it. So there's only one letter. If that letter comes after noon or tanween, you supposed to change the n into n Okay? Now, let's try to understand this here. Where is ba after makul? Where is ba? Well, Yes, the ba is in the next surah. So they put meme here thinking that if you wanted to connect both surahs together, you would be connecting ma'kulin with bismillah. Ma'kulin, that's a noon, silent noon. Bismillah, that's a ba. So what we are going to do here? We are going to change the n into um. So we are going to change Ma'kulin Bismillah to Ma'kulin Bismillah. And this meme you will see at the end of some other surahs as well. In Surah Quraysh, the last word is Khawf. But it is actually Khawfin. But when you stop, you say Khawf. If you were to connect this word to the next surah, you would say Khawfin Bismillah. Now when we connect them together, we are going to do the reverse one. Khawfin, Khawfin Bismillah, Khawfin, we change it into Khawfin. Barakallahu feekum. So a quick recap. The reverse type of Ghunna is when you change the M sound into M sound. And this happened when we have noon or tanween and after there is ba and that's it mm into mm let's go to some quizzes